Well, hello everyone. This is Dr. Eileen, and this is another Daily Dose of Medicine Walk. And for those of you who are listening in on Blog Talk Radio, this is Healing House Radio. So I hope everyone's doing well and protecting themselves and being really cautious about, you know, social interaction and social distancing. You know, it is just such a difficult and, and challenging time. You know, whether you're empathic or not, it's it really is a hard time and it's very easy to get you know kind of disheartened it's very easy to think that this is never going to end which it will it it one day it will end and then after that we'll have some other crisis we'll deal with but this one will eventually end now it'll end sooner if you know we can do the things we need to do to take care of ourselves and it is about self-care and that's one of the things that you know is really important right now especially for empaths and one of the ways that we take care of ourselves is by cutting loose every once in a while you know be a little be a little crazy i mean you know not going out without a mask crazy but just indulging yourself you know at home and and you know really finding something that will amuse you and empaths love to be happy. You know, it's, it's one of the things we resonate the best with because it is such a positive, light feeling and we're able to enjoy and embrace things a little bit more easily than others, especially if we're around other people who are having a good time. Now, it's important to keep in mind that you know we can't you know go all empaths gone wild and how you enjoy yourself and how you find those pleasurable moments you know there can be light and shadow in that because for some it is indulging or overindulging in things like alcohol or medications or you know other things that will alter you and you know among those can be food among those can be you know physical relations or something like that you know which considering social distancing and all that unless you're already in a committed relationship that's not going to be a major issue for a while but uh it really is important that as we find those ways to let off some steam and let our hair down and you know kick up a little bit of fun that we be responsible that we take a look at okay if this is you know maybe an evening of enjoying a glass of wine while you're on a video chat with your friends if it's a glass of wine you know even every one glass of wine even every evening but if it glass turns into a bottle or if you know treating yourself to ordering a pizza becomes two pizzas and it becomes every other night if the way that we let off steam becomes unhealthy and it becomes a pattern that's the thing we need to look out for and for empaths that is especially important because with all of the hard energy that's kind of coming in right now it's really easy to fall into those comfort modes and when you know it's good to go there but try to figure out whether or not you're having to go there a little bit too much and I get it I totally get it you know from the time this crisis has hit to now it's just all I can do to not overeat because for me food is that comfort um, I don't enjoy drinking very much especially if I'm around other people because for me alcohol intensifies my empathy and you know some people drink because it numbs them down well for me it has an opposite effect it will intensify it so that's why I really don't enjoy you know having much alcohol around a whole bunch of people especially when I know that there's going to be a lot of negative you know potential for negative emotions or argument so figure out what it is that will help you to let off some steam to enjoy it you know turn on some music and dance around your living room or you know watch a marathon of something that makes you laugh you know maybe an old TV series or something like that but finding those ways to lift your spirits 
and you know if you are in quarantine or if you're on you know lockdown with family members finding ways for the whole family to be able to enjoy themselves to have kind of a fun you know shake up the routine because with this we fall into routines and we need to shake that up every once in a while but make sure you're doing it in a healthy way and also make sure that you're doing it in a way that is not being influenced by other people's energy you know if, if you have housemates and they want to all get slammed and you're really not into that just because they want it doesn't mean that you need to want it so you know, be able to stay in your space be able to you know not get sucked into something or what is more prevalent now is when people hey come on you know let's go do this let's go do that and you know are saying you know that's really not social distancing or I mean the COVID parties which I see no sense in whatsoever don't get pulled into doing something just because you need a break or you need something different and get sucked into it because you're picking up on someone else wanting to do it and their instinct and their potentially poor choice becomes yours because your empathy sucks you in so make sure that you're finding some ways to you know to shake up the routine to give yourself a little break from the seriousness and have a little fun but always remember to keep it in moderation always remember that we still need to stay safe and you know the old saying never gamble more than you're willing to lose so take care of yourselves and indulge just don't overindulge and if you feel that you know you really can't shake this if you feel that you're really in a rut that you can't get out of please reach out reach out to someone talk to someone reach out to me my email address is in the description and I'm happy to answer questions and you know even if you'd like to set up a video chat I'm willing to do that and you know I'm here to help but there are a lot of people who want to help so make sure that you have your support system in place and make sure that if you end up you know not being able to break out of that you know case of the blahs and you know if it's really serious if, if this is impacting you talk to someone reach out it's okay other than that you know maybe enjoy you know that pizza or that glass of wine just do something special for yourselves because you are special and these are tough times and we all deserve to have a little something special for ourselves so thank you for joining me and if you have any questions comments or concerns you can place them in the comments section those of you who are listening in on blog talk radio please follow the link for the YouTube channel that's in your description and you can uh, come over and visit the channel and if you like this video please press like and if you kind of like what we're doing then subscribe that always helps out the channel and um, if you have any questions that you would like me to address if you have anything about your experience as an empath or dealing with an empath if you have anything like that going on please feel free to contact me and I will address it in a video or if you'd like me to address it personally I'm happy to do that so again thank you for joining me as always I wish you balance and I wish you blessings from my heart to yours love you and see you next time bye